take a classroom of kids. We're going to paralyze one of you so we can all watch you play football. Logically, it only makes sense. I don't want you rolling dice for me. Foolishly thinking, you can play games with my welfare. I find that obnoxious. Even if your life doesn't suck, the fact is, is my life's been sucky enough where I had a taste of it and I said, that tasted bad. But what I'm really afraid of, what I really find offensive, is a ton of people got it worse than me. There's no way I want to be born in some African goddamn ditch. There's no way I want to be born in Indonesia or some other shithole. No way. No fucking way. And yeah, it scares me. It scares me to live on this planet with you sadistic motherfuckers. I'm expressing it, and others have also raised their hand and said, me too, here, that, yeah, we do care, okay? We really, 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 really care. Okay, we find this disgusting that you assholes are going to keep putting us at jeopardy to play your silly game, that we're going to be the fodder for that. You no, know, I don't appreciate it. I think you're disgusting, horrible, arrogant, obnoxious monsters. Horribly frightening. The horror will continue. There will be kids who have their arms ripped off by weak combines in the future. The kids will end up paralyzed at 10 years old in some stupid football game. Spend the rest of their life drooling on themselves. And they find it horrible, the prospect of that meager, grisly, difficult, pointless survival, a futile existence in pain. Yeah, that sounds pretty awful. I find it obnoxious. I wish there would have been somebody who would have had a little bit of a serious conversation with my mother and explained a little bit of the facts of life and the risks she was taking and the chances taken, and she would have maybe behaved differently. She, in hindsight, recognizes the folly of her experiment. She watched her daughter die. Obviously, what's being bemoaned is the fact that this decision is made by arrogance and obnoxious, self-indulgent emotionalism, nonsense, culturalism, silly reasons why people have kids. They do not have them rationally. And that is being bemoaned. If you people had a really good argument for your obnoxious optimism, then somebody could make sense out of it. But you're just walking up to me and telling me it's worth it. And nowhere in my brain can I calculate this worth. Yeah, I find it obnoxious that you will presume to play God when you haven't proven the quality of your perception, of your judgment. Somebody regretting a decision isn't going to fix anything. What has to happen is people have to be prevented. You have to prevent the future crime. Lamenting the past crime doesn't do any good.